Hello everyone, I welcome you all for SVK tutorials. In this session, I have taken a very important topic which is for uh, VTU syllabus and also for autonomous syllabus. That is uh, Runge Kuta method of uh, fourth order. Those who are not subscribed to my YouTube channel, do subscribe to my YouTube channel. So first, let us consider an uh, initial value problem called dy by dx which is equal to f of x comma y with initial condition y of x not equal to y not. So for the given uh, differential equation, I need to find uh, the solution y at uh, x0 plus h which is called x1 where h is nothing but called as step size. So for this first we need to find the values k1, k2, k3, k4. So it is given by the formula k1 is given by h into f of x0 comma y0. K1, k2 is given by h into f of x0 plus h by 2 comma y0 plus k1 by 2. K3 is given by h into f of x0 plus h by 2 comma y0 plus k2 by 2. And Finally, K4 is given by H into F of X0 plus H, Y0 plus K3. So, using all these four values, we are going to substitute in Y of X1, that is X0 plus H, is given by Y0 plus 1 by 6 times of K1 plus 2 times of K2 plus K3 plus K4. This is the general formula for solving the initial value problem by using Runge Kuta method of fourth order. Now let us see one of the problem to solve such kind of a problem. So I have considered the problem using Runge Kuta method of fourth order find y of 0.2. This is what uh, I can say that this value is x1. I need to find the value of x1 that is y of 0.2 for the equation dy by dx equal to y minus x divided by y plus x y of 0 equal to 1 by taking h equal to 0 0.2 with a step size of 0 0.2. So going with the solution, so according to data, whatever the given differential equation, whatever the given differential ordinary differential equation, name this uh, function as f of x comma y first. Denote that by as what? f of x comma y. So then uh, with the initial condition y of x naught equal to y naught. This is x0 value and this is what y0 value. So for that reason, I have denoted x0 value and y0 value with the step size of h equal to 0.2. Also adding a 0.2 and 0, I am going to get y of 0.2. I need to find that value now by using RK method. So for finding, for applying RK method, first I am going to solve f of x0 comma y0. First I am going to find f of x0 comma y0. As I told you, what is x0? What is y0? Just I have denoted that x0 and y0 by the value called 0 and 1. So this is the value I have used here. So now I am going to substitute this uh, f of x0 comma y0 value in the given function. So how to substitute in the given function? How to calculate? So I am going to make use of calculator. So in that I am going to type the equation. So I will take as the equation is in terms of uh, fraction. So I will consider this fraction first alpha y this is what y minus alpha x in the denominator for denominator I am uh, just moving this joystick to denominator. So the, in the denominator we have y plus x y plus alpha x this is what the equation we have. So, I have used that equation. Now, press cal, cal C. So, it will ask the value of y. What is the value of y here? The value of y is 1 here. The value of y is 1. Press 1 equal to. And the value of x is what? 0. Give 0 equal to. And it is giving the value as what? 1. So, for that reason, I am going to get the value as what here? 1. I got the value as one year. So next, after finding uh, the value of x of x not comma y not, first I will find out k one. I am going to find out k one. What is k one? K one is given by the formula h into f of x not comma y not. So I have already find out f of x not comma y not. What is that value? One. So into h value. H value is what? It is known for us point two. So, for that reason, I am denoting k1 as what? 
0.2 times of f of x0, y0. If I just substitute this expression in the given equation, I am going to get the solution. Now, let us see for substitution using calculator. So, for this, how to type this expression means just move this joystick. Just I uh, move this joystick. I am going to get this expression. See, just I am moving this joystick. That's all. So I I am going to get uh, the given function. So then I will press the left hand joystick, left side joystick, so or right side joystick. You can press. So then you can type point two multiplied with the given function. Then press cal C. It will ask the value of y. So what is the value of y here? It is one. It is what one. Give x y equal to 1 and what is the value of uh, x? Give x equal to 0 plus equal to it will give in uh, fraction. If you press SD, you can if you have been fixed for uh, four decimal place, it will give the answer in for four decimal place. Therefore, the answer is 0 0.2. Therefore, the answer is what? 0 0.2. See the answer. So the answer is 0 0.2. Next, I need to find out what? K2. So, K2 is what? Is given by H into F of X0 plus H by 2, comma Y0 plus K1 by 2. What is the formula? X0 plus H value, that is 0 0.2 divided by 2, comma Y0 plus K1 by 2. K1, just now I have found out K1 divided by 2 plus, point, uh, plus Y0 value. So, I need these values. So, let us see. How to solve this in your calculator? You can first uh, calculate x0 plus h by 2 uh, manually. So, or you, you can make use of calculator, no doubt in that. So, you, anyhow, you can you should know how to solve using calculator. So, just for to get uh, k1 by 2, already I have 0 0.2. Just I will divide this value by 2. I am going to get that value as 1 by 10, which is nothing but 0 0.1. Plus y not I have I have what so I have y not I have what y not value here y not value is what one plus point two by two I need to do point two by two and x not value is what zero plus point two by two so this is what I need to find out now this is what I need to get so for that reason I have divided by Two here, I got point 0.1, and I need to add this one. For that reason, I will just plus one for that, and I am going to press equal to. I'll retain the answer as it is. I'll retain the answer as it is, and we know that what is the value of zero plus point two by two? It is point 0.1. So I got the value of uh, uh, f of k two as what point two into f of point 0.1 and 1.1 this is x value and this is y value x0 plus h by 2 is 0.1 and y0 plus k, k1 by 2 is 1.1 so now i need to solve this in your uh, calculator so let us see for solving this calculator so just press this above joystick so you are going to get until you get this expression press the above joystick here so once you got this expression Press cal C, then type the value of y, what we have y here, 1.1, press 1.1 and press equal to and it will ask the value of x, x value is what, 0.1, x value is what, 0.1, press equal to and it will give the answer as 0 0.166, this, um, this line represents recurring, the value 6 recurs here, that's why it is getting 1.666. So, the answer I have written here as what? 0.1667. So, similarly, I am going to find out K3 value. K3 is what? H into F of X0 plus H by 2, comma Y0 plus K2 by 2. What I need to find out now? I need to find out F of 0 0.0 plus 0 0.2 by 2. Already I have got this value, which is nothing but 0 0.1. And here 1. Y0 value is what? 1. 1 plus k2 value. What is k2 value? 0 0.1667 divided by 2. If I solve this, I can get the uh, solution for k2.
So what we are going to get here k2 is nothing but 0.2 times of f of 0.1 comma 1.0835. Let us see how to get this in your calculator. See now. Just already I have got a k2 value. This is what the k2 value. So k2 is divided by what? 2 here. Just divide by 2. Just divide by 2. I got some value. And k2 by 2 is added by some value called 1 here. So plus 1. Make sure that y not value so therefore add y not value i am going to get y not plus k2 by 2 as 1.0833 recurring this is what the value i got in your calculator you will get the same value don't uh, be worried that i have got line here here uh, i am uh, i have given here uh, the values don't worry about this in your uh, in your calculator it will give one fix for four decimal and solve definitely it will give 1.0835 cell so I got uh, a y naught plus k2 by 2 and already I know x naught plus h by 2. Just what I am going to do now, just move the upper joystick until I get this 0.2 into f of x comma y. Once I got this expression, I will press cal c. I will give the value of y. y is what? I can just give answer since as I have already entered 1.0835. I have got already just press answer equal to and here you can give 0.1 x value is 0.1 equal to. So you got the answer as what 0.166919 sir. So up to 9 decimal uh, 10, uh, 10 decimals they have given. So therefore this is, the, this is what the answer we are going to have. So K3 value is 0 0.1662. This is what the answer we have got in your calculator rounding off for four decimal places so similarly i am going to find out for k4 k4 is nothing but what h into f of x naught plus h comma y naught plus k3 just what i need to do whatever the answer i have got for that i am going to do just plus y naught value that's all y naught value is one so that's all i am going to do this is what i have K4 as what? 0 0.2 times of f of 0.2 comma 1.1662. This is what the answer for y naught plus k3. Y naught plus k3. For x naught plus h, x naught value is 0 plus h value is 0 0.2. 0 plus 0 0.2 is 0 0.2. So this is what x value and this is what y value. Now again, what I am going to do, just I will move the upper arrow here. So I got the expression, just press cal c. Already I know the value of y that is nothing but answer press equal to just type the value of x. x value is 0 0.2 equal to you are going to get the value of k4. So the value of k4 is what? k4 make sure this is k4. k4 value is what? 0 0.1414. So this is what uh, k4. So after finding all these uh, Values. I am going to make use of uh, Runge Kuta method of uh, fourth order general formula that is y of x naught plus h equal to y naught plus 1 by 6 times of k1 plus 2 k2 plus k3 plus k4 by substituting all these four values in this expression along with the value of y naught. I am going to get the final answer as y of 0.2 is given by 1.1. 679. This will be the approximate solution for the given differential equation with an initial condition. This is the easy way of solving this problem. If you really like this video, kindly do subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video with your friends. And finally, I thank you all for watching this YouTube channel.